Now, the country's COVID-19 cases continue to climb with health officials announcing 84 new cases and an additional two deaths. Of the new confirmed cases, two are on Abaco, five on Eleuthera, 14 on Grand Bahama, and 63 are on New Providence. Males represent 39 of the new infections, while women account for 45. The new deaths are that of a 62-year-old man and a 66-year-old man, both of New Providence. Both also died on Friday. Now, the Bahamas has a total of 6,352 confirmed COVID-19 infections, and of that number, 2,313 are active. There have been 132 confirmed deaths, 3,867 people have recovered. And with 33 new cases of COVID-19 recorded on Grand Bahama over the past two days, Minister of State for that island, the Honorable Crazy Thompson, is urging residents not to let their guards down. The increase in infections come after several weeks of numbers being down. Minister Thompson commends residents for their efforts in self-discipline over the past few weeks, which contributed to the decrease in new cases. However, as daily activities resume, he is encouraging them to continue to follow the safety protocols of wearing masks, washing hands frequently and thoroughly, sanitizing frequently touched surfaces often, and avoiding large gatherings. He is also reminding business owners to continue to enforce health protocols with employees, rather employees and customers.